the Watchman and the Watchman Flex, which is the newer generation of the same type of device, is used to reduce the stroke risk in AFib. It's not a device that's used to treat the arrhythmia itself. It doesn't stop AFib, but it stops the risk of stroke associated with AFib, which obviously is very important. Again, the way it works is more of a mechanical uh, prevention of clot formation in the left atrial appendage, as opposed to thinning the blood so that clots don't form. This is a device that actually sits right in the left atrial appendage, essentially blocking the appendage, not allowing clots to form there or allowing any clots in the appendage to leave the appendage and go to the rest of the body or brain and cause a stroke. Patients that qualify for a watchman device have to have underlying atrial fibrillation. They have to be at at least a moderate to high risk for stroke, and that's based on risk factors such as hypertension, age, prior strokes, et cetera. Uh, they also have to have an elevated bleeding risk uh, or issues with bleeding in the past where it's deemed to be high risk or unsafe for them to be on a blood thinner. 